Hi guys, so today we're going to talk about the golden ratio. Now this is the universal law that makes up all living things. <laughs> kind of crazy, huh? So it makes up the smallest things you know of to the largest things. So you can think of anything natural like a tree, including us, our craniums, our uh, life forms, so a shell, a fish, anything you can think of all follows one law and that's this golden ratio. So when you're looking at the uh, evolution of a biological system, this is the same law that it follows. So you can start with this progression from a gene to a protein to an organelle to a cell to a tissue to an organ to a biological system to a planet to a big solar system and then go 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 and from here go 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 it's all the same thing so we're all following the same pattern of evolution so how does this relate to how we understand ourselves I think it's really nice to understand the interconnectedness of the universe so through this ratio you're in interconnected with everything so that means you're interconnected with the smallest parts of you the tiniest genes to the largest parts, the big solar systems, the stars as far as the eye can see. You're also interconnected through your planet and your social systems. So this disconnection from each other is really an illusion. And as soon as you can understand that, you can start to come out of those beliefs of the mind because a lot of what the mind will perceive is due to uh, disconnection and thinking we're not connected. And as soon as you can kind of grasp this idea of interconnectedness, you can start to call yourself back into the present moment. I'm not saying it's easy, but it's a process and it's a concept that you can start to use to try and understand how you might be connected with everyone and everything else. I encourage you to try to process this a little bit, do some meditation, and you can think about in your meditation from the smallest things to the largest things, everything's connected with the same principle. So size is a bit of an illusion there. Good luck with it. I encourage you to reflect and uh, ask me any questions.